Good happy Sunday afternoon to you. How are you guys? We are off to do our Sunday shopping. To Whole Foods and um, I don't know maybe we'll get some clothes for Nick before it's big trip. Can you believe, I can't believe I forgot about the time change yesterday. Olivia, I forgot about the time change. Wait, so it's 309? So it's 2. It's 2 o'clock. I gotta look and see. I two, just two oh nine. Computers two oh nine. Oh, was it two oh nine? Okay, it's two oh nine. It's two oh nine. So uh, even this morning, so we've been we've been like really like behind the eight ball all day, and then we got a we got a, a nice. Um, we had a nice really good Bible study with um, a, a, a Facebook friend. How else do we know her from? Periscope. Periscope. So I'm really excited about that. And we gotta get going. Did you get the napkins, Peanut? Yeah. Thank You're you. On video. Here we go. I'm on video? Yeah. Hi! Hi! How are you? Good. So, um, yes, I gotta go though. Did they make them right? We went, we're at Hookalitas. Did I say that right? Did they cut them in half? I told them to cut them in half for you yes, guys. So, um, with you the like them time way, change, uh -huh. I want to eat at Whole Foods. They don't want to eat at Whole Foods. They want to have hookah so they're eating in the van. This is something that we let's almost go. never do. I'm getting hungry. Daddy's getting hungry. So let's go to Whole Foods for, for our yeah. lunch. Whole Foods. Whole Foods again, you guys. But you know what? In my defense, we go to Whole Foods every Sunday anyway. Sometimes we might go a little extra in a week, but we come every Sunday. So I'm going to get myself a delicious salad. Ten. The salad is so good, you guys. I am four. You don't be touching the pizza. Mm -hmm. It looked a lot better before I started eating it. But it's so delicious. Let me close this box up. We're home and you guys like grocery hauls and I'm glad about that because I want to share with you what we got today. We went to two stores. I was going to go to Costco and we got there too late because we met some really um, good friends that we haven't been able to keep up with and we talked for a long time and um, we got to Costco after it closed. So at least I've got some stuff from Woodman's Market and from Whole Foods. So let's get started here. All right, first we'll get here with the dish dishwashing supplies. We've got our green, green clean um, sponges. I really like these. Um, dish soap. I'm not gonna say um after every item. I hope not. Oranges, pineapple. Cool dog treats. Sweet potato and okay, apple. Now the game. What's the other one? There's only five ingredients. The game. Peanut butter and banana. Five ingredients. I think is that this is only five ingredients too. Hold on. No, they're both only five ingredients. Five ingredients. What's the five ingredients? Uh, oh, flour. Oat flour, peanut butter, banana, honey, and canola oil. That's it. And Rocky really likes. I know like some it. people question canola oil, but you know, they're Rocky pretty good. Rocky really likes them too. Yes, Rocky loves them. Yes. So rice dream. Original classic um, organic um, milk, rice milk. We got some plums, almond butter, coconut oil. I kind of protested on these things, but Daddy and the children love cold cereal. So, you know, I gotta pick my battles, right? Makes a sunrise, heritage flakes, and these come from Nature's Path and they are organic. So. Veggie straws. You guys, seriously, who got the veggie straws? Nick. That was not going to be on our um, budget this week. Bonitos, bean chips, and a dahlia. <laughs> We're going to plant this sometime. Isn't that beautiful? It's a bulb, one bulb. How much do we pay for this bulb? Two something. Two something? All right. And then we got a few fig bars. Uh, maybe 40 fig bars. They were on sale for 39 cents a piece, so Nick decided that we needed to stock up. Tortillas, Olivia likes these, right, Olivia? Yeah. Brown and rice Dad ones. Likes and Daddy likes these. And a lot of people don't like these ones. I know they don't like them, but you like them. And if they go out of business, I'm gonna be really mad. 
<laughs> Toilet paper. A couple, of, a couple of bananas. Bananas are cheap, you guys, and they're really good food. Couple. So this I is like, not a couple. So we eat lots of bananas. I know. It's not. Get your hairbrush away from the food, Missy. What's the matter? Oh, you're counting them. Okay. Butternut squash, because Olivia and I love butternut squash soup. Cucumbers. Cilantro. We haven't had haystacks in a long time. I think we're going to do haystacks this week sometime. Peppers. Tomatoes. And then, finally, um, a coconut water. This is the harmless harvest. It's not um, reconstituted, not from concentrate. It's um, not pasteur pasteurized. It's not heated. It comes straight out of the coconut. This is the best way, unless you actually buy the coconuts and drink them right out of the coconut. So, um, there's a, actually, there's a couple other brands that are like this. I'm not sure. We don't, they're hard to find. We don't have them around here. But this is a good, we like this. And um, we don't get this all of the time. There's 48 bananas. Oh, thank you so 48. much. 48. Thank you. That was so important. It was. Ugh, brother. So, um, so, yeah, coconut water. We love it. We don't get this all the time because this is pricey. Egg expensive. X expensive. Egg expensive. Egg. <laughs> like an egg that's expensive. An egg expensive. And Rocky's chewing on her. Rocky's very happy to have us home. Yeah, Rocky. Aren't you, Rocky? She didn't have any problem with her harness. Right? That's good. When I got home, she was sleeping. In the All right. It's tea time. Tonight, everyday detox. And um, I like this every once in a while. I don't really know that I like the taste of it very well, but I like the way it makes me feel. And... Um, just the fact that it de is detoxifies really well. It supports, see that, it supports healthy skin and liver function. And it's got a nice lemon flavor. But it, it's okay, it's good. I like the 99 the best, though, <laughs> to tell you the truth. But um, it has some interesting ingredients. Let's see if I can, if we can get this going here. Here we go. Burdock root, stinging nettle leaf, cleaver's herb, dandelion root, and myrtle leaf. Lemon myrtle leaf. So, um, yeah, it's kind of interesting. But um, the stinging nettle is really good for de detoxifying, and the dandelion root's good. These are all really good for you. Not that I'm really big on the taste. It's not too bad. It's not my favorite, though. <laughs> but I like what it does for me, so that's the big thing. So, you guys... Tomorrow is the last full day that Nick's going to be home with us. We're going to be busy tomorrow. That could be a good thing, too, so that we're not thinking too much about it. But Nick's going to be climbing the walls. He is so excited about this trip. So, um, yeah, we're going to do some... we got to do some packing, and i got to do some laundry, and I might have to go out. We didn't get the things that he wanted to get, everything that we needed to get for the trip. There's some clothes. There's some pants that he wanted to get. We did get him little travel alarm clock and he's he's thinking of all kinds of little stuff he's just so excited you know it's so i'm gonna turn that light off and i'm like why i'm vlogging he's so excited about going you guys i'm really surprised because he's he's really never been well he went to my to my mother-in-law's for a couple of days to visit for a little bit but he's never been away from us any longer than what three days and that was just one time so we'll see how it goes. We'll see how it goes. I'm going to go ahead and have this reading because that clock says 9.25, but it's really 10.25. I don't like this time change, really. Okay, let's read. Okay, tonight's reading is going to come from the devotional that I've been reading in the mornings. It's called... Um, our Father Cares, and that's also written by Ellen White, and it's a daily devotional, so every day of the week, every day of the year, um, for a year, the book goes through and has a little devotional. And this is actually from yesterday, but um, I thought it was pretty fitting for us, and I just wanted to share it with you guys. Um, it's called, The Just Shall Live by Faith. As ye have therefore received Christ Jesus the Lord, so walk ye in him, Colossians 2.6. Our growth in grace, our joy, our usefulness, all depend upon our union with Christ. 
It is by communion with him daily, hourly, by abiding in him, that we are to grow in grace. He is not only the author, but the finisher of our faith. It is Christ first and last and always. He is to be with us, not only at the beginning and at the end of our course, but at every step of the way. So it's impossible to grow in grace or have any joy if we're not communing with Jesus hourly, daily. And it's easy to forget, but it shouldn't be. You know, if we love him so much, everything we do, everything we say, everywhere we go, everything about our lives should be about the Lord, about serving him and about allowing him to abide with us. And uh, it's special. You know, it's, it's so amazing that he wants, he loves each of us so much that he wants to be that close to us and to be that much of a part of our lives to where we, comp we are completely absorbed in him. So anyways, that's beautiful. That's a beautiful way to end the night. I'm going to go for now. Oh, you know, I better say a few things first. I wanted to go for now, but I better say a couple things first. I almost forgot. First of all, um, I, for I, I wanted to share with you about what we were doing before I stopped doing the daily vlogs, and that was having you send me a video of you or your family, your friends or whoever, saying live well and be strong for the end of our vlogs. And we had a few of you do that for us, and it was just great. I should, um, I should put a link to those that did that so you can see the ends of them and see how well it turned out. And I would love to be able to um, have you be a part of doing the vlogs by um, sharing with us and sending us a little clip. So if you want to do that, you can just take a video on your, on your phone or whatever and just um, send it to me in my email. And that will be in the um, description below, but it's stacyb88 at gmail.com. And I will put it in the description below. It should, uh, it should be already there. And another thing is, is when we hit a thousand subscribers, I'd really like to do a giveaway. I'm planning to do a giveaway. I'd love to give something to all of you. And I'm just so thankful for all of you and those of you who watch. Um, it means a lot to us. It means a lot that that God has been able to um, allow us to be a blessing to you and to allow us to learn from you all, from you all too, just to have that sense of, of community. And it's been, a, it's been an interesting journey these past two years doing these vlogs and um, just doing this channel. And I just pray that God continues to bless us and that we can just continue to do it. But um, anyways, the giveaway is going to be really fun. But I'm going to wait till we get a thousand subscribers and then um, we'll talk more about what we're going to do. So, okay, on that note, I'm going to go. Have a good night or a good day, whatever time of day it is. And we'll see you next time. Don't forget to live well and be strong. Adios. <laughs>